This is the Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor, America's most prized military asset, so advanced that it's off limits to the rest of the world. Developed under stringent international export controls, this fighter jet is reserved exclusively for U.S. forces, ensuring its cutting-edge stealth and avionics technologies remain out of reach for potential adversaries. Widely regarded as one of the most advanced and capable fighter jets ever built, the F-22's unparalleled performance and classified features make it a true game-changer in modern aerial combat. In this video, we'll explore 10 fascinating facts about the F-22 Raptor and uncover what makes this aircraft so exceptional. Stay tuned! The F-22 is a true air superiority fighter, designed with a first-look, first-shot capability. Its AN-AGP-77 Active Electronically Scanned Array, or ESA radar, allows it to track targets while remaining electronically silent. Raptor pilots can also receive information from other F-22s. This means that even if an aircraft is outside its missile range, it can still track a target and discreetly pass that data to a nearby Raptor for a stealthy kill. The result? The enemy never even sees the Raptor before it strikes. To support its attack capability, the F-22 is capable of holding a large quantity of weapons while staying stealthy. However, the range of weapons it can use isn't super extensive. Right now, it's set up to carry short-range AIM-9 Sidewinder and medium-range AIM-120 AMRAAM missiles for dogfights. Plus, it can also carry different types of JDAM bombs for hitting ground targets. What's a fighter jet without some speed, right? The F-22 Raptor is powered by two Pratt & Whitney F-119PW100 turbofan engines that come with afterburners and cool two-dimensional thrust vectoring nozzles. This setup lets the Raptor zip up to and maintain speeds around Mach 1.8 without even firing up the afterburners. If it does engage the afterburners, it can hit speeds over Mach 2. When it comes to maneuverability, the F-22 is equipped with engines that have two-dimensional thrust vectoring nozzles capable of moving more or less 20 degrees. This feature lets the aircraft direct its thrust in different directions, which means it can pull off intricate maneuvers and stay in control even at steep angles of attack. Thrust vectoring boosts the jet's agility during combat, helps prevent stalls during intense maneuvers, and offers benefits like shorter takeoff and landing distances solidifying the F-22's status as one of the most advanced fighter jets out there. Talking about the Raptor combat capability, this fighter is designed for both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions. But most people would argue that it really shines in air-to-air -air combat. Interestingly, its debut in combat was actually an air-to-ground operation back in 2014 in Syria, where it successfully targeted an ISIS-related site with impressive precision. As a fighter known to have a great stealth capability, the F-22 is built with a focus on keeping its radar signature as low as possible. Its unique curves and sharp angles help scatter radar waves in different directions, so they don't bounce back to the radar source. Plus, the way its wings are positioned makes the plane look tiny on radar, almost like a little bumblebee. Even though the F-22 has been really good at staying under the radar, there have been some recent claims from China saying they can spot it. We're not sure how true those claims are, 
but they highlight the need for ongoing improvements in stealth tech to keep these valuable planes safe from new threats. The fact that this fascinating aircraft is not allowed to be exported definitely raises some eyebrows. The key reason for this is that the U.S. military is keen on keeping its edge over rivals, so it's not willing to share any advanced tech. This covers exclusive and possibly sensitive technologies that are crucial for how the F-22 operates. However, the tech secrets might not be the only reason for the F-22's export ban. With only around 190 units in existence, selling them off would really put a strain on production and availability for the U.S. military. Since the F-22 is exclusive to the U.S., this has led other nations to create their own versions. For instance, China developed the Chengdu J-20, a stealthy fifth-generation fighter that looks a lot like the F-22, featuring a broad fuselage, a sharp nose, and a canopy without frames. The U.S. has pointed out that the J-20 is something to keep an eye on. Meanwhile, Russia's response to the F-22 is the Sukhoi Pak Fa, marking their first foray into stealth tech. This jet is designed for super maneuverability, super cruise capabilities, and advanced sensor integration. While this fighter jet is so impressive that other nations are eager to replicate it, the F-22 Raptor faces a lot of criticism for its high costs. Operating the F-22A reportedly costs over $60,000 per hour, which takes into account the total ownership expenses, including upgrades throughout the jet's lifespan. Back in 2014, the F-22 fleet needed more than 40 hours of maintenance for every hour of flight. As the years have gone by, it looks like the maintenance demands have shot up significantly. Overall, the estimated life cycle cost for one F-22 Raptor is around $334 million. High price is not the only problem surrounding the F-22. There's been a concerning rise in hypoxia-like symptoms among its pilots, including dizziness, confusion, and poor decision-making, which raises serious safety issues. What do you feel number 14? Four, four of spades, four of spades. Four of spades, four of spades right now. What would you do right now, sir, if you was an aircraft? Four of spades, four of spades right now. These symptoms are thought to be linked to the combat edge flight vest that can restrict airflow along with problems with the onboard oxygen generation system and possible toxins leaking into the oxygen supply. This ongoing problem has led to a dip in pilot trust in the aircraft's breathing system, making operational safety a big concern. So, what do you think about this U.S. stealth fighter? Leave your thoughts and thanks for watching.